I'm now going to continue my video series on English grammar etymology with modals. All right, what are modals? Where does it come from? It comes from the Latin word modus, which means measure or method. So you're measuring something here, or you're having a method on this, okay? Modal verbs are often used in subjunctive clauses, okay? And what is the etymology of the word subjunctive? The word sub means under, and the word, now keep in mind that in the Latin alphabet they do not have the letter J, and you should know this from Harrison Ford. If you don't know this, uh, you might want to do a little research, okay? Now, because they don't have a J, it is I-U-N-G-E-R-E, -E. that is the word, it is, it's actually a verb, okay, it's a Latin verb, I-U-N-G-E-R-E, -E. and that Latin verb means to join together. Okay, so you're joining something together under something else. All right, so uh, if you want to look up extensively what a modal is, it, as far as I understand, it's related to something called an ablative absolute, which I will do a different video on at some point in the future, but you can kind of see how it's related to that. All right, so you now know what a modal is, at least you know the etymology of it. And if you have any questions, leave them down here in the comments below. I will tell you more in a future video, so I'd like for you to stay tuned.